what's up today my fellow man soldiers so what i'm going to be doing in this video is basically reminding you guys that season three is coming to an end if you can see right here it says it archives in seven days and 16 hours by the time you guys see it it's probably going to be less days so i want to go ahead and make sure i get this video because if i do this video on a day before season three which i might too just in case that some people want to buy like last um use some of their tickets or if they want to save them i might just do that but when it comes to speak about what i'm about to speak right now i need to make sure i do it i did one a while back about like two weeks ago three weeks ago because it was good enough time to prepare you guys now there's seven days ticking and i told you guys i'll do another video to make sure you guys prepare and i'm going to show you guys how you guys can make sure you guys get all your rewards and stuff like that and not just that to make sure you love what because there will be there will be new xp coming in the game so i'm going to break it all down right now so let's go ahead and get into it because there's a lot to go over right all right so the first thing i want to do is come to the season pass go over a few things in there and then i know certain people are going to have questions about xp and everything else so i will break that down right now but one important one important thing to highlight um for those who 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 don't already pay attention to your daily objectives you're going to want to make sure you do your daily objectives because if dog just off your daily objectives alone, you're you're gonna get over 13 to 14,000 season XP every single day. That's a lot of season XP. So within what was it like six, seven days, seven days, seven, we'll say seven times what seven times seven times fourteen. Seven probably just a little under, but seven times um yeah, seven times fourteen thousand. 14 there we go i was like oh, i was like hold on that's less than fourteen thousand. so it'll be about i'll say 98 98 to 97 it says ninety-eight thousand, but i'm going to calculate it about ninety-seven thousand xp in seven days that's a lot of season xp so for the next seven days at least make sure you guys do your daily objectives uh, i'm gonna go ahead and open up my my most feared pack before i forget to one coin this right here is not an 84 plus or anything like that. It's just an 84 off the top. Don't really need this card. So I'll go ahead and get my free training out of it. Anyways, let's continue on. So yeah, so you want to make sure you do your season XP the next seven days. You're going to get over about 97,000 season XP. So that's going to be a lot just within those seven days. So make sure you guys get that done. That's one way to get your XP every single day guaranteed because it resets every day in order to help you guys level up your field pass, which we'll go over right now. Another thing too, you see we got programs right here. We, well, the most feared is over with, but we do got the unstoppable program currently active. Um, I still need to finish my rushing touchdowns, which I'll go ahead and get either today or tomorrow depending on how much games i'm gonna go ahead and play i can get this done right real quick if i want to today but either way i'm gonna knock this out and keep in mind this there's a release to of the unstoppable program so it depends on when you watch this video but currently as i'm making it right now the release two is not out it will be out tomorrow once again depending on when you see it this video will be out on wednesday uh wednesday the 13th just wanted to make sure i got the right date uh wednesday the 13th so the the release two of the sample program comes out on the 14th so if you're watching on the 13th just know tomorrow there there should be updated objectives to where you can earn season xp and according to this this is giving you 57,000 season xp so i'm assuming with release two they're going to give you guys some more objectives and i'm assuming it's going to be another 57,000 season xp so that's quite a bit of xp so make sure you guys get these objectives done and keep in mind, it's telling you guys to make sure that there's at least two unstoppable players in your lineup. I'm pretty sure a lot of us have those two unstoppable players, but just in case you don't, make sure they're in your lineup. And if they're not that good of a card, put them in your, put them as your backup, just so these uh, objectives could start tracking. All right. And then keep in mind, currently at this moment, the new weekly objectives are not in the game. But by the time you watch this, most likely they might, might be in the game. But because it's early in the morning, pretty sure they're not yet. Um, hopefully by the time you watch this, they will be. But if it's not, then hopefully they should be coming out today because they um, they should have been in the game already. But for some reason, they haven't reset it. So hopefully they reset it today, which it's supposed to. Um, and there should be a week, um, five weekly objectives. So therefore, each one contains you get 26,000, 26, 26, 26 so that's a lot of season xp and most what over a hundred thousand season xp just off the weekly objective so that on top of the other 
in the daily objectives and the program objectives, that's going to be able to help you up level up fast. And if you haven't got these other weekly objectives done, you go ahead and knock those out to help you level up and get your rewards. Now let's go to the rewards, right? You're going to want to get this done because once again, they give you free players. They're going to give you... They're gonna get where, where, where's it going? Okay, they're gonna give you tickets, and they're gonna give you um, players and stuff like that in order to help you help your um, your team out. Now the tickets, right? Because I know a lot of people got tickets. Some people got a little bit. Some people got a lot. Um, depending on how much you've been grinding. Me, I had more than this, but I used some of them to buy some tokens. And, uh, use my tickets to buy some tokens in the store to upgrade my players. And I told you guys before, the smart thing to do would 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 be to, would be to fully upgrade. All right, to have enough to tokens to be, to be able to fully upgrade two of your players up to a 91 overall. So even if even if one of your players, like say for instance, you end up pulling, because one of them is a Titan. Let's say for instance, you got a 91 overall Titan, you, you, you upgrade them with the tokens and then you end up pulling a 91 overall or getting another, like even if it's an 89 or 90 overall Titan, um, and you feel like, oh man, why did I use my tickets on this? Well, the good thing is you could d downgrade the tight end that you that you upgraded with your tokens and use it on one of your other players. So that's why I tell you guys at least get enough tokens to fully upgrade two of them. I wouldn't upgrade all of them or like four or out of five of them or like that because to me it's a waste of tickets. Just upgrade two of the ones you want, and then once you once you uh, end up with another player or you you get another player of that same position, you could downgrade it and use those tokens on another player to help your team out. That's a smart way to do it. And any other tokens you have left over, like the tokens I have right now, I'll only spend about a thousand or more once I get this. Okay, so once I get up to an 89 overall, get this 89 overall token, hopefully I get it soon, very quick, because I'm close to getting up to level 45. Then I'll get the token 90 and 91. But if for some reason I'm not able to get up to level 45, then I'm going to buy enough tokens to get my second 91 overall. So that's what I'm waiting on. And any tickets I have left, I'm going to I'm gonna allow those to transfer over there to season four. So I can go ahead and have some uh, extra tickets. And hopefully they release some good players because if they do, then I'm going to have enough uh, players to start off with. All right, now let's go to my item binder. I'm going to go over a few things. All right, let's go ahead and get this out the way. All right. Here we go here. All right, so now let's go over here to my item binder. I'm gonna go to the seasons and I'm gonna show you guys some stuff right here because this is very important on why you want. A lot of people should have this already because I think this came pretty early on. If you don't have this, I mean, apparently you haven't been doing that much grinding, but I got quite a bit of tokens. But is this, it's this season XP token right here. All right, from what I see, there's only one of them in the game. I don't think there's two of them. There's only one of them in the game, but this is a, Hold on to the season XP token for when season four launches to place it into, into a set that will earn you season four XP. So this is what you guys are gonna want and grind for. Once again, everybody should have this by now because I think it was available in like, like level 14 or 15, 15 or something like that. But this is very important for us to make sure we get. So to help us be able to level up faster when it comes to season four and to be able to get a few rewards as soon as, as, soon as season four drops. So that's one thing I do want to put out there and let you guys know. But make sure you guys get on it. I wanted to make sure I get this video out. There is seven days. I might do one a day before, just as a reminder, because there may be there may be some people that are waiting to the last day um, to make up their mind on what they want to do with their tickets. And I want to make sure that I do a reminder. But for now, if I don't, then this is going to be the last video for that up until season four. Then on season four hits, I'll make a video on season four. But we'll see. I might do a, a video a day before just as a reminder. But once again, um, I just wanted to make sure I remind you guys so you guys could be on top of it. And you guys will miss out on everything that you guys got coming. Until next time, I'm out.